Our morning prayer time today is about making comparisons, inspired by a Kansas pancake fun fact. People often say Kansas is flatter than a pancake. But is that comparison really true? Scientists actually worked on this question and compared the flatness of Kansas to the flatness of IHOP pancakes. I kid you not. Turns out that compared to pancakes, Kansas actually is flatter. (laughs) The Bible is full of interesting and life-changing comparison language. And in our morning prayer time, we'll explore some of those comparisons, guided by the living words and Spirit of God. Let's pray. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your righteousness, O God, reaches to the highest heavens. You have done such wonderful things. Who can compare with you, O God? What are some wonderful things in your life and my life that only God could have done? Let's spend a moment reflecting on that. And let's thank and praise God for those things. May your kingdom come and your will be done. Lord, it is your will that we not compare our work and our wealth to anyone else, but rather to find satisfaction in a job well done. Is there anyone you and I are comparing ourselves to? Could we take a moment to pray for them instead or reach out and encourage them today? And give us this day our daily bread. The prophet Jeremiah observed the suffering of God's people and asked, To what can I compare their anguish? Your suffering and my suffering and our daily bread needs are unique. No comparison to others. Let's talk to God about our suffering and needs today. And forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. Jesus compared his kingdom to a king who settled accounts with his servants. It was a lesson in showing forgiveness and mercy to others, just as God has shown forgiveness and mercy to us. Who do you and I need to forgive today? Lord, our hearts are full of praise to your name because you have done such wonderful things and no one compares with you. And our hearts are full of purpose as we do your will, not comparing our work and our wealth to anyone else, but rather to find satisfaction in the job well done. And our hearts are full of peace as we no longer compare our suffering to others but rather bring our unique daily bread needs to you in a spirit of humility and dependence. And our hearts are full of freedom and joy as we see the picture of your kingdom compared to a king selling accounts with his servants, encouraging us to forgive others as you have forgiven us. No one compares to you, God, and yours, Lord, is the kingdom and the power, and the glory forever. Amen. If you'd like a transcript of today's morning prayer or email updates of future morning prayers, just click the link in the description below or go to lordsprayerday.com.